Hello again, HCGers. Like I told you, um, I was going to come back and give you a little bit of information on my um, journey as far as the HCG and how awesome it is. As I stated, um, I also said that I was going to show you a picture of me three weeks ago. How I look. Now, mind you, this, uh, can you see it? This is me three weeks ago. Can you believe that? Look at that round face. Pretty smile, but the face is round. It's, you know, oof, you know, thick diva in the house. Not saying that it wasn't, I thought it was okay, but, um, when I did my blood work and everything and the doctor told me that I was quote unquote borderline diabetic had thyroid issues and my iron levels were low and didn't have any muscle can you believe that no muscle it looked like muscle to me anyhow that's all said and done I am just like I said telling you how awesome HCG is and how it is for me gosh I'm looking at that picture again wow can you say moon face <laughs> anyway it's you know funny to joke about it now um, but at that time um, really thought nothing was wrong with me um, other than that I was a you know short thick girl um, which a lot of you know people you know guys may like but um girls health is the key and the point is you gotta look good for you um guys you gotta look good for you health wise um anyway i'm not gonna sit up here and have a, a lecture about um how you, you need to look and for other people and all that other kind of stuff we're on the hcg kick well anyway um, I just wanted to let you know that, okay, I think I said it again, HCG is awesome, but uh, with HCG comes responsibility, and the responsibility is, is being on the low calorie diet, 500 calories, yes, I said it, 500 calories, I'm sure you've looked at all these other um, videos, and they say 500 calories and things like that it's serious it's real um, I do it a little bit different and I spread the 500 calories throughout the day um, depending on you know my hunger or um, things in the morning uh, in the morning I do the three egg whites and the one boiled egg so three boiled eggs I take the egg whites out of three, I mean, I take the, the yolk out of three of the boiled eggs and one of the eggs, I can have it. Now, how to make this work, because if any of you have had, um, what's those egg beaters in the little carton or whatever, that stuff is gross to me. It may, they say you, it's acquired taste. I ain't acquired it yet, by no means. So, with that note, I just boil the um, organic eggs, take the the yellow yolk out of it, and I use that one egg that has the yolk, and I mash it up into little pieces, almost to the point where you would think it was scrambled. I guess I fake myself out with that, and then I get the everyday um, turkey bacon by Butterball. It's like a dollar fifty in the grocery store. I get three of those and three of those turkey bacons are like um, 40 no excuse me correction it's about 35 calories with those three turkey bacons and they're awesome they're thin and um, they curb your appetite and I drink um, a cup of coffee it can be organic you don't like I said you don't have to do all of that um, get regular Folgers coffee decaffeinated or with the robust I don't put any sweeteners Woof! that took a while um, to do that because um, 
I gotta have some kind of sweetener. I gotta have some kind of sugar, okay? Really? For real? You know, I was a thick girl before, you know, I need that sugar. I need some kind of sweetener in there. Black coffee? Who would have thought? But I drink that stuff like it's water because I guess I've been so watered down um, that even if the coffee doesn't have any sugar, it's like um, still good to me. It has that flavor. At least it has a little bit more flavor than water. Oh, and did I tell you that I did not like water? I thought it was like poison. Okay, please don't quote me on that. That was just my personal preference. It tasted like poison to me. I had to have some kind of sweetener, whether it was Crystal Light or one of those little packages that have the Hawaiian Punch that says sugar-free, um, which didn't taste sugar-free to me. That was the only way that I was going to drink water. Now, I drink water like I'm a champion of water drinking. That half, half a gallon of water is awesome. You don't have to do the full gallon. Some people feel bloated, and with us being women, if a woman is watching this, um, you have the tendency to feel um, bloated, and sometimes when I would walk, when I did drink the gallon of water, um, I felt like my stomach was shaking, and like the all the water that was in there is just like, okay, I'm doing all these character moves and things like that, but hell, that's how it felt. Um, also, okay, phone ringing says unavailable then I'm unavailable too um anyhow um with that note um you can keep it strictly to a half a uh, half a gallon of water and that's consisting of your teas um your green teas and your um your water um and your coffee um you can drink as much as that as long as you're getting that fluid intake um I'm not a doctor, so um, what your doctor may tell you to do, you can do, but this works for me drinking the half a gallon of fluids um, per day. Um, anyhow, um, you, I don't get the parchness, but I just have that craving for water, and I drink my water room temperature um, merely because it, it, tastes, it tastes good, and yes, if it's getting hot, I live in Texas. So it gets excruciating hot so I may put a few ice cubes just to give that little tingle of coolness but um, I heard and don't quote me on this that if you drink um, the water extremely cold you know to quench your thirst it slows down your metabolism but like I said don't quote me on that that's just something that I heard and I think I read it too but you know I don't know if that person was a doctor or not but um, it slows down your metabolism so I don't need have no time for slowing down metabolism I need that thing to go up 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 okay um, I already told you what my breakfast consists of then I would drink my um, slim package like the slim drink that I told you that I was taking I was trying to look for that over here but can't find it anymore I would take a slim like 10 to 15 minutes prior to my um, lunch which my lunch is I found these awesome turkey burgers that are organic and at the Whole Foods store here in where I live um, they prepare it and they can cut it up into 3.5 ounces which is a hundred grams 3.5 ounces it has the green onion it has its gluten-free, um, salt-free um, flavor to it. And it has like a little kick because they put, you know, that coarse black pepper, which is awesome. And if I want that little salty taste or whatever, I get the um, idolized um, sea salt. Am I saying that right? And I sprinkle that on there and I put it in my George Foreman grill and then I fix me my organic leafy salad and sometimes I'm like getting up to be a pro at this because I don't add any dressings because I know they have this awesome dressing which is by Walden Farms they have the honey Dijon mustard did you hear me honey Dijon and it has an awesome taste it doesn't have that aftertaste that you get with some diet um, products also they have um, bacon ranch awesome
okay but anyway I I squeeze a little bit of lemon and then I sprinkle some Mrs. Dash on my salad to give it that taste sometimes I will add tomatoes it's depending on how I'm feeling and sometimes I just eat it green yes I'm going rabbit rabbit to good health but anyhow um, with that said um, that's what I eat and then you know I'll get like a half of an organic apple and then during my lunch I drink at least two bottles of um, the uh, the water or tea and um, FYI little information um, if you are drinking 16.9 ounce bottles of Orzacla, Aquafina, um, any type of water that says 16.9 ounces, in order to get your your gallon of water, if you want to do that, it takes seven and a half of those bottles in order to make the equivalency of a gallon of water. So just in case you want to have your seven and a half bottles ready for the day and you know that's your target goal in order to drink that then go ahead and do it okay now after I finish um, my lunch you know go through my day doing the stuff that I need to do around here in the house work fix hair and all that other kind of stuff and then um, it's lunch time I, tr I mean excuse me dinner time I try to do my dinner um, no later than seven o'clock to have ate dinner um, the reason being is is because um, that food needs to digest and if you stay up late or whatever the case is you need to at least be up three hours after the fact that you have ate your dinner because yes we are burning fat while we're sleeping but that's just leading to a whole lot of stuff by having that fat and um, all that food in your body and it's not properly digested um, drink some water um, some people may get quote unquote the itis after they eat try to get up and do something if you miss something in the house as far as cleaning or doing something or go wash a load of clothes just so you can stay up to keep your body together as far as um, having that energy so you won't fall asleep because don't sleep and you still got that lump of being full it's not going to work I'm it, it just doesn't work for me point blank so with that note um, also um, if you are a woman that is on her menses it's good to also take a iron supplement um, whether it's pill form or liquid form this helps you a whole lot because um, being a woman that um, had a menses it's important to have that iron because you're losing a lot um, during your menses cycle so um, suggest to incorporate some iron in that just to get healthy um, also um, makes the energy levels um, better um, as far as um, iron um, it would be better to take the liquid form of iron merely because um, it doesn't have to go through the breakdown process as if you were to take a pill um, so with the pill it doesn't absorb through your body as would a liquid so I tell you that in order to enhance that um, also um, just just keep on staying motivated this I tell you is fantastic is awesome um just if you're losing hope um get on this HCG diet it it is merely awesome I've seen the results with other friends that I was like there's no way in the world that you could lose all this weight that fast yes you can and mind you it is wonderful man I have not seen the curves of my body like this since mm, I have a 14 year old 14 years ago my youngest is 8 but um, I was sort of fine before him but um, what I'm feeling now going from a size 14 sometimes 16 to a size